Hi, Professor Mindy here to give you a few tips to help you conduct effective research. So let's go ahead and get started. Let's just type in a search term that we would like to find some information on. And I will go ahead and click this link right here. And if we don't want to sift through the entire web page to find what we're looking for, we can use a keyboard shortcut on the Safari to help find the information. So all that you need to do is click Command F on your keyboard and then type in whatever term you're looking for. So I am going to say, uh, let's go ahead and I'll just make it easy for now and type in Web, web 2.0. And you'll notice that when I do that, each instance where that information appears on the page is highlighted for me. So I can just go right to that information without having to read the page and search through it. Now, if I am not sure of what a word means, then I can quickly find a dictionary definition on the word through Safari by just right-clicking the word. So I'm going to select the word platforms as an example, right click, choose look up in dictionary, and I will get the dictionary definition automatically displayed for me. If I'm doing something else and would like the, the web page to be read to me, or if I would just like to have it read to me because I don't feel like reading it myself, I can highlight a selection, right click it, choose speech, and then start speaking. For Web 2.0 Summit 2010, we noted that the web ecosystem had shifted into something of a battlefield, with both major players and upstarts jockeying for lead positions around key points of control. Okay. So that is also great, of course, for 504 compliance. So just to highlight the three tips that I've covered with you on using Safari to conduct effective research is that once you have clicked on the web page, if you would like to find the information you're looking for, remember you just click Command F on the keyboard, type that information in, and then the information will be highlighted for you on the web page. In order to bring up the dictionary definition of a word, remember that you just click on the word, select the word, right click, choose look up in dictionary, and then to have a selection read to you, remember you simply highlight the selection, right click it, choose speech, start speaking, and that information will be read to you. I hope you've enjoyed this brief tutorial to help make conducting effective research a little bit easier. Thanks for joining me. Have a great day.